Hey guys, welcome back to another clothing haul video. If you are new here, hi, hello, and welcome. If you are returning, thank you so much for your support. In today's video, we will be doing a Walmart fall haul. I know, it's already here. So I thought we would focus in on jeans in this round because there were some really good jeans I had been mentioning all summer long to keep an eye out for. They were the No Boundaries 998 jeans and I was finally able to find them in just about every color and uh, in my size because they had been out of my size so I wanted to share those with you. <laughs> So this outfit that I have on now is kind of transitioning into fall. I don't know why they had this shirt out there. It's more of a summer top. Um, and even though through August and September we still have some really hot days out, um, I thought that this would be perfect for that time. So it is just this cute blue um, top. It's a very stretchy here. It does have the spaghetti straps here. I don't know why they're so huge on my shoulders. Um, you would definitely need to like figure out your bra situation. <laughs> and these actually serve no purpose since they're so big, but um, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, the top is super adorable. This is in a, this is from No Boundaries, a size extra large. Maybe I could have even went with a large, but um, here is the price. And for reference, I am five feet tall. I am 32 around the waist, which is equivalent to a size 14. Um, large or extra large, depending on brands. And then I am 36 around the bust line and a large extra large, depending on brands as well. So now you know I am a short girl and these pants are short girl approved. Now these ones happen to be the No Boundaries jeggings. These are not the 996 jeans. These ones were actually 1288. And when I switch outfits, I will share these with you. But they have this really cute waistline up here. And I thought it would be really cute to pair this top with some light washed jeans. So here are the jeans here. And then there is the back of that going on. I have shapewear on underneath. So that's why I was like not wanting to share that with you guys. But um, yeah, there's sh so short girl approved, super cute top. Keep an eye out for it. It is adorable. It makes me look like I'm gonna salsa dance. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, let me share with you. Oh, I'm going to keep these same pants on because I want to try it on with this really cute shirt. This is a size medium from Time and True. And it was $11.98. I thought this was just so cute. It has actual real functioning buttons and a little tie knot there at the bottom. Perfect for transitioning into fall. Um, you got the darker color, but you also have the short sleeves. So if you are, I know here sometimes when we go to the pumpkin patch in October, it'll be blaring hot during the day and then ice cold freezing at night. <laughs> so this is something that's good to wear for that type of occasion with some jeans, you know. So let me try this one on. All right guys, before we get into this top, I just wanted to share this cute little uh, top while it was on the hanger rather than on me. So look at how pretty that is. And yeah, so there's that. And here is the top that I'm wearing. I really like this. It looks like I could have even went down to a small. So that is always good news. Um, I do love the button detail. I do think it's very comfortable and definitely very, you know, fall approved. And again, still wearing them with the light washed jeans. So the next outfit I have is like, we got some stuff going on. Okay, so here are the um, 
9.96 jeans that I found from No Boundaries, and we went with a size 15 because, um, like I said, I'm a 14, so I always just go up to a 15 since that's how their sizing is. Now these are the skinny jeans. I have heard boot cut is coming into season. I didn't see any, so um, you know that's still be to be determined. They still have plenty of stuff to bring out. Um, I'm sure, but for now, uh, this is what we're going with is the skinny jeans in the light wash. Then I found this really cute, stretchy, uh, spandex type t-shirt. It has the, it's the ribbed material and this was from No Boundaries in a, oh, it looks like I got this in an extra large and it was only a $5.98. So then what I want to do is I want to top it with this little cardigan. I think it is just so cute. And this is going to look so cute with some boots. I don't have boots down here, you guys. Um, this is a small medium. Although I sort of feel like it could be a one size fits all deal. It's not uh, from, the time, from the brand at Time and True. So I thought this would be really cute with a pair of light washed jeans. So let me try that on. You guys, this is easily my favorite, favorite outfit out of this haul. I mean, look at this. This is a bag that I had from Target for a couple of years. I keep it down here in this room as decor. And then I... <laughs> I just think it looks so cute with this. And then I did run up and get my boots, so I have them with some tan boots. This is so freaking adorable. This is definitely that outfit that is like, I am ending summer and starting fall with a bang. Okay? Okay? <laughs> Alright, I'm just, I'm totally just kidding. I learned half that stuff from my kids when we goof off with, you know the new lingo and stuff but anyway isn't this so super cute um yeah so this thing is is huge like it's very oversized um it, it was the smallest size that they had so there's that but it is definitely really cute um, I think you could even wear it with a long sleeve, um, like turtleneck type thing if you wanted to. And yeah, here is the back. So since I'm short, it's obviously gonna go pretty far down as far as that goes. Um, here is what the holes, <laughs> the armholes look like. And it has this really cute little detail here on the side. So I really adore that. Now as far as the pants goes, they are high rise, which is what they said they were, so they go up just a tad bit above the belly button. And the pants are really long for me, it's just that I have them kind of tucked in the boot. So I don't know about that part, just depending on the type of shoes that you're going to wear if you are a short girl. And then here is the white shirt, it's very stretchy. Um, I think I probably could have done a large instead of extra large, but I'm still really happy with this. This will go with a lot of things. Um, I know we're not supposed to wear, are we not supposed to wear white after Labor Day? Because like I feel like that's so 90s and like for me personally, I don't even care. Like who cares? Whatever for me. Uh, so yeah, and actually with white being mentioned. I did grab these. They also have the 998 pair of pants in a white. Also the um, skinny jean material. Super high rise. I actually wasn't going to try these on but I did want to mention that they have this color and uh, they're very lightweight and flowy. They are not necessarily a very, well they're like a, they're a little softer than jeans or they're a soft type of jean and I just thought that, you know, since they had my size, I was like not going to pass up getting them. So even if I don't wear them for, you know, before Labor Day, <laughs> then um, 
then I will still have these for next season. Better to be safe than sorry, girl. Okay. All right. The next outfit I have. Oh, hold on. All right. I forgot to show you the jaggings that I was wearing when we first started out the video. So here is the waistline. So it is very stretchy and makes them very comfortable. And here was the pricing, uh, $12.88 and the size and all that. So I definitely really liked these because of the length. I think that I liked these better than the pair that I have on just because of that length or uh, because they, um, well, because of the length, these ones are too long. Also, just to, for comparison, these were a tad bit lighter wash than what I'm wearing now, even though they're similar, so you could go with either one if uh, that's a concern. But again, as far as length goes, I am preferring these at the moment. Nothing wrong with the other ones, whatever. <sighs> Nothing wrong with the other ones, however. Okay, so these jeans are like the acid wash, and of course they were a skinny jean. I totally was in love with these. These are no boundary. Look at the waistline on these. I just thought that it was so cute and just a little different from regular jeans. These ones were a little bit more pricey. They were in the $14 price range, and again, I got them in a size 15. And then I found this really cute top from Time and True. And I bought the, I got this in a small just because it seemed to kind of run large for $9.98 or run big. So it has like this little puff sleeved detail and then has this little, you know, detail there around the armband. And I thought it would look cute either tucked in or untucked. So we'll give it these two a try. Again, these would look really cute with some black boots. Okay, hold on. All right, guys, here are the acid washed black jeans with the black top. I think this is so freaking cute. I absolutely love the jeans and I am so pleased that they are short girl approved. <laughs> so that's always a bonus. And here is what the back looks like on these. This is what the shirt looks like tucked in. Um, the shirt is still like, it's crazy because I think it is still big. Like you, the small is pretty big. Like I feel like this fits like a large. Um, I think if they had an extra small, you could still size down to it. Even the arms here are not tight. I was kind of worried um, that these would be really tight, but they are not. And they're there's still so much room in here. However, it's the type of the material that kind of clings to the body. So it, even though it has all this extra-ness, um, you can't really see that, which I like, which is, you know, um, I'm, if they don't have a smaller size, you know, you're safe with it. Here is, okay. Here is what it looks like untucked. I'm an untucked kind of person. Like, I prefer my stuff untucked. I don't know. Um, my babe says it makes me look shorter when I tuck stuff in because the pants look like they're going up higher. I don't know. Um, but anyway, for me, it's more comfortable like this. Anywho. So here is what that looks like untucked. So I think definitely either way, it's super cute. Uh, you can wear a really pretty gold chain with this and definitely some black boots. I only brought the brown boots down. So um, yeah, anyway, there's that. So I'm super in love with the jeans for sure. Uh, the, the top is so cute. Um, so there's that. All right, the next thing I have here is we have a pair of the black 998 No Boundaries pants, again, in a size 15. They are the high-rise skinny. Like I said, I got them in every color. We're going to try them all on. And then I found this really cute tie-dyed shirt. It has a little crisscross applesauce there. And then it also has a tie 
in the middle. It's the very like stretchy thin spandex material. So definitely be comfortable as we're going into fall. So let me try that on. All right, here is the tie-dye shirt with the black pants. So let me just show you guys what I'm talking about with the length. You can see that they go under my heel, so they're very long. Um, if you have like, you know, the taller type boots, it's generally not a problem. You can, you know, stuff them in there. Um, if you're wearing tennis shoes or booties, then it's quite another thing because you'll get that slouchedness there at the ankle, which I don't personally care for. Um, but I'll deal with it just because I'm short and it's like, I mean, I already know what it is. <laughs> so as far as they go, though, they are very nice and they fit very well. They go very nicely to the curves. Here's the back. So they they are very nice for sure. Very light jean material, not too heavy. Um, and then I love the top. The top is obviously that really stretchy spandexy type material. Um, I probably could have gone a size down just because of the stretch that it gives. I love that it is already tied up. You can probably untie it, but I really like the tie. Um, in my last hauls, you can see I do that anyway. So yeah, this is a really great shirt. Did I tell you guys how much it is? Okay, I did not tell you how much the shirt is. So, $7.98, and this was what? A large, so I guess I could have gone with a medium on this one. And then I really think that this detail was cute as well. Gives you <laughs> a little bit of cleavage, but not too much. So, yeah, I think this one is very nice. Um, so with, with these being long, um, I want to try, well, I was going to try these out anyway. These are the jeggings, similar to the first pair I tried on. So they are the 1288 and I'm curious to see if these ones will be the same length as the other jeggings because then I may just end up going with these. So this is why we try all the styles, guys, all the colors, because even sometimes a color may be different. Now, these feel more like a nylon um, material. They definitely don't feel like there's any jean in it whatsoever, like not even a little. And then it has the waistband here, so I'd say more like um, definitely... It has a nylon feel to it, but not a tight nylon, more of, I think, mixed with cotton, and they are pretty thick. So um, I thought I would try that on with this shirt just so we can change the top. This was featured in my last Walmart haul. I'm just mostly using this to pair up with something, um, but I'll share it with you guys again. It's from Time and True, and it is in a size medium for $9.98. So let me get that on. All right, guys, so these pants are interesting for sure. Uh, they do not fit like the other jeggings that we had. They run a little tight, like they're not uncomfortably tight, but when you do this, like I can feel the tightness all, it's like the thigh and hip area. And so then also because they're like this nylon, they're like a non-stretch nylon fill, if that makes any sense whatsoever. Um, when I was putting them on, I could feel them like, like if you bend over and stuff, you're, you can feel the pants like slide down your butt. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but they like, because they have like this slippery feel to them. I, I can't explain it. I do not like them. I don't recommend them. Um, here is the waistband. So it's not like they don't fit. It's just that they don't stay on. <laughs> so they're really weird. I definitely feel like you'd be uh, doing a lot of this during your day. When you go to sit down on a chair, you'd have to make sure this back doesn't slide down your booty. 
So I don't know what the deal is with this type of material. It's the material though. Uh, they're very pretty. They look really good on and all of that stuff. Um, they fit fine. <laughs> the length is amazing. So I'm kind of bummed because I... <sighs> I don't necessarily want to keep the other black pair because they're too long and I don't like the feel of these materials. I'm a, you know I don't like restriction and it's very much the texture. I've mentioned this in another video, side note. As a child I used to cry because my clothes hurt me and everybody thought that I was just a crazy, they would call me Sybil because now, if you're older, you'll know the reference um, because of my mood changes and my mood swings. Um, and a lot of that was because if my pants were tight or uncomfortable or I didn't like the material, I, I would have a grumpy day. And I'm still like this till this day. Like, I will not be nice. I will be grouchy. I will not be pleasant. Um, these pants, these pants are that. So anyway, um, I'm not going to talk too much about the top because it was in my last haul. Obviously, uh, you know, they are a little oversized for their sizing, which is why I got it in the first place because I, I actually bought this to pair with loungewear and it did work out. Um, I, I still have two more outfits, so so don't get bored and, and uh, cut out yet, guys. Alright, so look at how beautiful these jeans are. I was so excited to find these. They are such a beautiful color. They are a um, skinny jean. These ones were a little pricier. I honestly almost didn't want to spend this much on a Walmart brand. But I did because... Oops. Be but I did because you know if the quality is good, you like you know what you're getting, so there's that. And also, I thought this was a really cute thing, is underneath the distress scene, there's like, there's a patch or like um, still some jean material under there. And then we have the distressed on the back. And I'm going to pair it with this navy blue. Don't let it deceive you guys. It is not a black shirt. It is navy blue. Um, the same stretchy material as the tie-dye. So I may have even... I should have gotten a size down. But anyway, look how cute the back is. It has this little cutout. And it has this little ring here. This one, this was the only size they had. Like, it was just hanging out by itself <laughs> in the store. So this was a large and for $7.96. So let me try these on. Alright guys, I am in love with the jeans. So I guess paying more for No Boundaries is definitely worth it. I like them, they fit better, and the length is perfect for short girls. Um... I love it. They are called, I guess I didn't mention this before, they're curvy for everybody. Super high-rise jagging. Oh, they're jaggings. When I take them off, I'll show it to you again because I can't get it in the camera. Um, here's the shirt, though. It, it is pretty big on me. Like, I have all this extra room up here. But again, this was like just, I looked, I looked in the store um, so that I can get it out to you guys and this was the only one just all willy-nilly by itself and um the only size they had so i will definitely try and link it down below but here is the back of this so it is very cute again it's just because it's so big on me that um you know we can't see its full potential but believe me it is there it is there it is such a cute top especially paired with this color of um, jeans I think they go really well together um, so the um, next outfit I have for you are another pair of the 998 jeans now these ones are a really dark wash and they have a brown the brown jean stitching on here and I thought that um, I would try it with this brown shirt 
I think this will look really cute tucked in similar to like a bodysuit um, like it'll give that bodysuit silhouette effect hopefully um, without it being a bodysuit so let's see oh pricing pricing um, this is just the super soft material um, fitted tank for like $3.96 there's no price tag on it and then these ones again like I said the $9.98 here's the sizing okay <laughs> guys here are these pants with this super soft t-shirt so first of all this shirt is amazing second of all if you've seen my skims haul if you haven't actually go check it out these three dollar shirts way better way more comfortable so soft not see-through like I didn't be I I tried to believe the hoopla and no like go with something like this to give you that I mean obviously you can fix this up so it looks better than you know us just trying it on here but I definitely do think you can get that same thing out of this three dollar t-shirt now the jeans I think that they did pair very well with the with the brown shirt. I had actually bought this brown shirt for something else and those shorts are like lost in somewhere. Those are lost somewhere because Walmart hasn't sent them to me yet. And then the bummer part though about these jeans is again they're long. So the 996 jeans are not all the expectation I was hoping that they would have. So there's that and then sorry guys I was rudely interrupted but anyway um I was going to say that you can also as we're transitioning into the fall you can wear this outfit and then if it gets chilly you can just put an oversized hoodie or sweatshirt or some kind of cardigan many options to go with that the last pair I want to try on for you guys is this one. It is a camo print jagging with the waistline here. Um, I'll probably just pull a shirt we've already seen just to get an idea with this, okay? Okay. All right, ladies and giants, here are the camo pants. I did put it on with this shirt because I felt like it didn't get the spotlight that it deserved and I did decide now that I'm wearing it without the uh, cardigan that it is very big for me so I will I do love it so I'm gonna try and exchange it for a smaller size um, I did tuck it in for the purposes of this video and here I love so I think I like the jaggings more than the 998 jeans which I'm kind of bummed about in a way so the length is perfect I'm only bummed because I was looking so forward to it and I was like guys 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 you gotta check it out and now that we've checked it out well I guess worst case is that we know um the jaggings definitely are my friend <laughs> so I do really like these they've got that stretch and they are so comfortable in the legs um and then yeah so let me see here is Here's what it looks like untucked so it definitely could be really comfortable as a bigger size shirt there's that um, and then let me just share with you the tag on these jeans as promised these say that they are a um, they are curvy for everybody and then they say here on the top Super high rise jagging, no gap waistband. And that was so true. Um, and it did, it says here that it hugs your curves. I do find both of those to be true. So both these jeans um, have that label on them. So I thought that was. Um, important to mention before we end the video if you have made it this far thank you for sticking with me I thought they were really great pieces and uh, definitely got to experience the Walmart jeans so there's that um, please stay tuned for our next uh, video which will probably be a Target fall haul um, 
And remember to like, comment, subscribe, share. Help me get out there because I enjoy doing these videos. I enjoy interacting with you guys. Um, comment down below and we will see you in our next video. Bye!